Hello there and welcome to Aberdeen Airport. Today we're going on a flight with Wizz Air. Wizz Air only operate one route from Aberdeen, so it's over to Gdansk we go in Poland. Let's go. Arriving at Aberdeen Airport, our flight over to Gdansk is the last flight of the day. Wizz Air operate this route from Aberdeen to Gdansk once a week or twice a week, depending on the time of year. Once through security, it is a quick walk through duty free and a very quiet Aberdeen Airport. Most of Wizz Air's flights from Aberdeen operate late at night, when the airport is quieter and generally cheaper to fly in and out of. I was about one hour early, so I decided to find a quiet spot to sit myself down. Not much is open in Aberdeen Airport this time of night, just duty free, WH Smith and the Distilling House Bar. So our flight today is actually the last flight out of Aberdeen today. Like I said before, Wizzair only operate one route from Aberdeen and that is to Gdansk. I really just wanted to get a, a nice Wizzair video under my belt, but it is night time so I'm not sure how the footage will come out for this video, but hopefully we will get to explore Gdansk tomorrow. Um, we're just checked into a hotel just opposite the airport. Um, sleep and fly I think it's called. So I'm gonna stay there. We've got about an hour's wait till the plane arrives. And then I think it's a quick turnaround. Wizz Air is known to have quite short turnarounds. So just gonna wait for about an hour. Maybe get another coffee. Don't have a lot of coffee this time of night. I have heard good things and bad things about Wizz Air. So we'll see how we get on. Soon our aircraft arrived on the inbound flight from Gdansk and slowly the airport started to get a bit busier with other people arriving. As the time for boarding came, the number of people waiting at the gate clearly made it obvious that it was going to be a packed flight. I didn't care though, as we would be going through the mythical gate one. Hello, just your passport sir, thank you. Perfect, thank you, cheers. Once through the gate, we were held in the corridor as passengers from the inbound flight were still disembarking. Once all the passengers had been disembarked, we were led out for boarding. Our aircraft today, taking us over to Gdansk, is this A320neo. Wizz Air operates an all Airbus fleet consisting of variants from the A320 family. Wizz Air actually has the largest order book of any European airline, as it is looking to become the largest low-cost carrier in Europe in the near future, directly taking on airlines like Ryanair and EasyJet. I originally was meant to be sat on the left side of the aircraft for this flight, but swapped seats with a woman so that she could sit with her husband. I did pre-book the seat, but the swap was to another window seat, so it really made no difference to me. I paid for the window mainly. This though would turn out to be a good trade for filming. After a very quick boarding and safety demonstration, we began our taxi out to the runway. The flight time today should be around 2 hours 40 minutes. The flight takes us over the North Sea and Denmark and landing into Gdansk at 1.30 in the morning.
Taking off into the lights of Aberdeen below us, we begin our flight over to Gdansk in Poland. Shortly, we enter the clouds, leaving the lights of the Scottish mainland behind and heading out over the North Sea. There really wasn't much to film on this flight due to the cloud cover and the night sky. Soon the crew came around with the buy on board service. I took a meal deal with a cheese and ham croissant, Kit Kat and a coffee. It came to £7, which is not a bad price compared to the buy on board service with other low cost carriers. Not long after I finished eating, we were passing over Denmark and began our slow descent into Poland. With the lights of Gdansk coming into view, we circled around for an easterly approach, giving us a great view of the city and the port.
I decided to wait for the mad rush to end before disembarking the plane, knowing that a long wait in passport control was ahead. After getting through Polish immigration, we have arrived in the Polish city of Gdansk. Now you might be asking about cost. Well, all my costs are down below for this flight and the hotel, but just the flight cost me £25, which for what it is, I think is great value for money. Stay tuned, as more videos from Gdansk will be out soon. My hotel is only a short distance from the airport, so I just decided to walk it. And so there we have it, Wizz Air's flight from Aberdeen to Gdansk. I'm here in my hotel room now after a short walk from the terminal. It was actually shorter than I thought it was going to be. I was debating on whether or not I actually needed a taxi, but so short. Um, yeah, it's a fly and sleep Gdansk airport. It's not bad. As far as cheap hotel rooms go, really not bad. Cost me like... 18 pound for one night so that's all I need and then tomorrow we are going to go into Gdansk and have a look around before our flight home. So anyway guys what did you think of Wizz Air? Are they an airline you would consider going on? I mean to me personally it just seems like a very similar EasyJet Ryanair experience. Um, the price was brilliant. I'll leave the price down below as per usual and well yeah what did you think? Is it good? Is it bad? You let me know down below. Anyway guys, if you like this video, please consider subscribing as it does help out the channel quite a lot. And as always people, we will see you all in the next one.